Well, hello everybody and happy Tuesday. It is Tuesday, March 29th. Can you believe it? I don't know why the wrong picture is on here. I just took a screenshot thumbnail for this video <laughs> and this is what the picture was of. <laughs> I don't understand why it keeps doing that. I set it up to go live and I hit the live button and then it says smile for a thumbnail and then it counts down one, two, three or three, two, one, and it takes a picture of whatever I have, and then it pops up on the screen, the same old picture from like two, a month ago. I don't understand what's going on with that, but um, hopefully you guys are gonna tune in and see what we're making tonight, which is this gorgeous card that I made today at one of my classes, and it is absolutely beautiful. It's another napkin card, and I'm like obsessed with these things right now because they're so cool. You can just take any napkin you want to and make a gorgeous card. And I just love it. So hopefully you guys can see me. Um, oops, I'm really crooked. All right, is anybody watching? I think I've got a bunch of people on here. Say hello. Let me know where you're watching from. I'm still crooked, darn it. I've got a mess on my desk too. <laughs> All right, hey Irene, where is everybody? I see there's people watching. Come on in and say hello and tell me where you're from. Look at this gorgeous card we're gonna make today. Well, tonight, because it's already seven o'clock. Seven o'clock Eastern time. And this started out as a napkin this morning and I transformed it into this gorgeous card. So it is so beautiful. And wait till you see, <laughs> it's a funny story what happened. The napkin is just so pretty. And you know what? You don't even really have to put the glitter on it. It's It looks beautiful without the glitter. So I actually am gonna do one with glitter and without glitter and see which one you like the best. Um, and we'll decorate that one. So, um, hey, Irene, Tina, Marsha, Melinda, Tammy. Hey, Debbie Chebitar. Now Debbie's the one who actually gave me the, the napkins this morning. So that's a funny little story I'll tell you about in a minute. Hey, Kai Omega, Melinda, Sharon, Irene, Leslie. Now we got everybody going. All right. Lots of people. Hey, kitty cat. Hey, Minda, Leslie. All right, we've got a good crowd going now. So if you remember from last week, we did a few cards with some glitter. And I'm going to give some of them away tonight. But to refresh your memory, this was the first napkin card that I did. And I also did this one, not on the video, but I just showed it to you. So these were the first two napkin cards that I did. And I just love, love, love this one. Well, I love both of them, but the this one was my favorite. And I've been giving away card kits like crazy. And I've sent about, <clears throat> I think, 10 kits in the mail so far. And I've got probably another... 15 kits to go so far. So um, I got to tell you a story of why I'm running late with those because my computer crashed um, on Sunday. Uh, not the whole computer. Well, kind of the whole computer, but I turned my computer on Sunday morning to send out an email to everybody um, about classes and just some updates and stuff. And my computer had updated overnight to some new stuff. And first it took like forever to come on and I was panicking and then finally it comes on and I hit my outlook uh, you know for the email and it just pops up and then it disappears and then I was like uh uh oh and so I hit it again and it kept popping up and then it went away and it kept doing that and I was like and then it just sends this crash report and I'm like oh my god oh my god <laughs> what am I gonna do <laughs> all my email is in there which the email I can actually get on my phone, but it's more the contacts that are in there. So, um, are you guys having a problem focusing? Let's see. Hold on. Uh-oh, somebody said it is blurry. So hopefully it's not. Hey, Starla. All right, so um, hopefully you guys can see me. I'm not using internet tonight. I'm using my phone. The um, the data thing from my phone. So hopefully it is good for you guys. Um, 
I've given up on the internet because it's just not working. So now I'm trying my data on Verizon phone. So hopefully it'll last for the whole um, video. And I don't run out of data. I don't even know how much data I have because I only have like 15 whatever a month. So hopefully it doesn't use that much doing videos because they haven't told me. And if I go over, I don't know how much that costs. But <laughs> anyway, so I've been giving away lots of kits, but then my internet, I mean, not my internet, my, my computer email has uh, crashed and I have been trying to send out emails for since Sunday morning and I haven't been able to. So I have been online like trying to research what's going on and um i don't know what's going on but i cannot get into my email on my computer to send out any emails to my customers or my downline or anything so um i'm panicking because that's how i reach everybody and i cannot get into my contacts so um i'm really upset about that so i have been spending hours on my computer trying to fix it and nothing is working so it updated the new Outlook and new um, Mac version of whatever on my computer that, I guess, Saturday night. And now nothing's working right, so I don't know what to do. But you can't get a human being to talk to you. So anyway, so let's get back to this. So anyway, if you have not gotten your kit in the mail, trust me, I will be sending them out as soon as I can. I have everything cut. I just have to put them all in the envelopes and address them all and, and do all that. So um, it's going to take me just a little while. I was kind of overwhelmed by how many orders I got because you guys are awesome. And now I figured out what to do. So each month I'm going to have to have some kind of card kit to give out for orders so that you guys um, will place orders with me because that was awesome. This is like a great month for me. So thank you, thank you, thank you to everybody that's ordered. And also I got a card in the mail. So this card is from Jan Shore. She actually got a card from me and sent me a card back. So I thought this was so cute. And this was using the um, celebration stamp set that we had. I thought it was adorable. So thank you, Jan, for that card. And then I've got some cards to give away. So I've got some winners here. So um, Donna Mongelli, I think maybe that's how you say it. You won the sunflower card with all the dazzling glitter on there. And then Sue H, I don't know what your last name is, but you said it starts with an H. Um, you won this one, which is the prized peony um, card with the glitter. And Cheryl Fagan, you won the Butterfly Jacobs Coat Technique. So congratulations, ladies. All you have to do is um, email me your address. And my email is stampgirl2 at cox.net. It's S-T-A-M-P-G-I-R-L, the number two, at cox.net. So I will get those in the mail to you, hopefully soon. All right, so let's talk about this card. So this is the one we're going to be making tonight. And this is, so let me tell you the story first. So we're at my class this morning. Let me show you what we made. So this was the original um, magnet board that I did a few weeks ago when I went to one of my downlines houses for the weekend and I made this one and so I showed it to some of my customers and they loved it and so they wanted to make it so then today we made another one but we swapped out the paper for the hand pinned paper so you can swap out any paper you want to go in here and I picked the hand pen pack of paper and just use that instead of the sheets that they give you in the kit. So I thought this came out really pretty and everybody had a great time. And this was the one that I made and the other girls, everybody made one different and I thought they were so cute. And the hand penned paper really matches the um, papers and stuff that come in there, all the stickers and everything that come in the kit. So I thought that was really pretty. So I'll be doing this video on Thursday how to make this okay so that's the next video so if you have one of those kits you can make it with me um, all right so let me show you what we're gonna do so what you need is I don't know why I feel like I'm so high up here let me turn it down just a little bit and it seems like it's so over this far I don't know why Maybe my phone over. <laughs> I don't know if that helps. <laughs> All right. Uh-oh. Somebody said it's 
a little bit blurry. I hope not. All right, so we are having my class today and we had a luncheon. So we go into the kitchen to have lunch and um, Debbie Chebitar, who's on here watching, she brought the paper products for today. So she pulls out these napkins and I said, I said, Debbie, we're not going to be using those napkins for lunch, are we? And she goes, yeah. She goes, yeah, I bought them for lunch. And I was like, uh, we're not using those napkins for lunch. We're using those napkins to stamp. And I said, we're going to make some cards with that. So we made cards. We, we all made the card today with uh, the napkins here. And these are from Amazon. And this company is in Germany where my friend Anya lives. And um, all the... The napkins that I have bought on Amazon are made by the same company, IHR. So they have absolutely gorgeous napkins. And these are actually six by six. And they're three, oh wait a minute, no, they're, oh, if you open them up, they're 13 by 13. So I guess they're a little bit like six and a half, maybe by six and a half. They're a little bit bigger. So they're not the cocktail napkins. So this was the original one, the dragonfly one. So you can see the difference. So it's bigger than the dragonfly one. And it actually works out better because it makes a whole sheet of uh, card, a whole card. All right, so then we've got eight and a half by five and a half soft succulent, but I think I might trade that out for a different color. So we'll decide after we put our napkin with it what color we're gonna use. You need two pieces of white, and these are four by five and a quarter. And I actually just trimmed this down just a teeny, teeny bit, so it's actually like, a sliver less than four inches because the sticker paper that I'm using here and a lot of people didn't realize we sell the sticker paper um, this one says Sizzix on it this is Stampin' Up's old sticker paper it's called adhesive sheets they're on page 167 and page 153 of the big catalog but they don't say Sizzix anymore they're just white I uh, you know Stampin' Up canceled their contract with Sizzix um, a while back and so now the sticker paper that we have is plain white it doesn't say Sizzix on it but we do carry it and I have some of the new one but I also have a ton of this one because whenever Stampin' Up gets rid of something and they put it on the clearance rack I stock up and buy tons and tons and tons of it because a lot of times all they do is change one little thing about it and get a new one so that's what they did with this so they changed the sticker paper to sticker paper without Sizzix on it. So um, I've been using this the, the whole time. So if you wanna get some sticker paper, it's called Adhesive Sheets. It's on page 167 um, or page 153 in the big catalog. And it's only $10 for 12 sheets of six by 12. So since I cut this at four inches, cause you can get three that way, and this was four inches, I wanted to have just a teeny bit of room so I just cut a sliver off of this so I would have not like right up to the edge so I just cut a teeny like a sixteenth of an inch off of that so it's just a teeny sliver less than four inches okay so that's what you need here and your napkin whatever napkin you want to use that's what you need for your project so take a screenshot of that it seems like I do keep getting blurry but I don't know I can never tell. My phone looks great, but my computer is a little bit blurry, so I don't know. Let me read a few comments. Oh, yeah, somebody said it is blurry. Well, <clears throat> I don't know what to do because I'm not using the Internet at all. So it's just straight, um, whatever you call that, LTE from Verizon now. All right, we've got a ton of comments on here tonight. Call the Geek Squad. I know. But they're like, I think about $150 an hour or something. I don't know how much they charge. Um, blurry, blurry, uh-oh. Now, my, my computer is clear now. It was blurry for a second. So hopefully you guys can see it. What does that mean, adjust under your quality? Maybe this does something. Let's see. It's on auto quality. So hopefully that should do it. Um, I don't know if I adjust that to something less, if it would do anything. Let me turn it down to 480. Oops. <laughs> I hope that didn't just make it go away. <laughs> Uh-oh. 
now my computer's spinning in a circle. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe that'll help the, uh, I turned it down to 480 instead of 720, so I don't know. Maybe that'll work. All right, so I'm going to take these stickers off. And thank you, thank you, thank you, Debbie Chebitar, for bringing these napkins today because that was a fun thing to make. So I've already cut this one in half, and um, we just need to peel off. Well, let me cut it into a quarter of a sheet. Let me find my, my scissors. You can take the whole thing off when you start or just, um, we have to peel those other two layers off because these are three plied napkins. I think it's actually easier to take the layers off after you cut it. So we can use either side of this. They're both so beautiful. I don't know which one to pick. Oh, I know we're gonna pick both because I'm gonna do one on one piece and one on the other. All right, so we'll make two out of this. All right, so peel the layers off and we've got three layers to take off here. Hold on. It was easier this morning. I got them right off. Okay, that's only one layer. I see it. Let me see. Oh, there we go. Oh, it came right off. There we go. All right, so took both of those layers off. So now you've got real thin. Let me do the other one. And we'll get that one really thin too. Yeah, you just gotta pick the right corner. Hold on, oops, there we go. I got two at a time, yay. All right, so now we've got both layers off. All right, so we're down to one ply. I'm gonna do my card across this way instead of up and down and see how that looks. Um, let's see, actually this one probably needs to go this way, I don't know. What do you think? I can't decide if I wanna get it this way. Yeah, let's do it like that. All right, so we're gonna do it like right here, like that, on that one. And then this one, we're gonna do like right, gosh, I really wanna get that blue one in there too. It's so hard to make a decision. I don't know. All right, we'll do that right there. Okay, all right, so that's what we're gonna do. So we need a glue stick. This is the best way to do these is with the glue stick. And if you can get the lid off, hold on, okay. All right, so I'm gonna put glue all over my white piece. And I probably should put some scrap paper under here just so I don't mess up my area. All right, so we're gonna put that all over. And I should use my little silicone mat. That would probably be better. And make sure you get all the glue all the way to the edge. All right, so we're good and sticky. And we're gonna put this right on top and try and make sure I get it where I wanted it. Let's see. It's hard to see it now because it's curling up. Let me do it this way. All right. Put it about right there. Okay, that looks pretty good. All right, so then we're gonna just press that down and then we want to fold it over. So what I did was I just put some regular old um, snail or any kind of adhesive you want. And let's just put it right down the edge. Oops. And fold it over. And you wanna pull it pretty tight and then we're just gonna trim this edge off. So I'm gonna trim that off. And there we go. And then we're gonna fold the next one over. And press it tight. And then trim that corner off a little bit. And then put some more. Make sure you're pulling it really tight on the edge. And you can trim this excess over here if you want to, if you don't want to have all that excess napkin. We don't really need that. Let's 
same with this one. You don't have to be straight. Nobody's going to see the back because this is going to be glued down. Okay. And then we want to just trim this little piece off. And you don't really have to be too careful because it's all going to be on the back and nobody's going to see it. All right. So then let's just do this one over the edge. And I think I want to trim that corner just a little bit more. And try not to cut the paper. All right. So there we go. All right, so now we've got that gorgeous. Oh my gosh, that's pretty. So that's our front of our card. And then we're gonna do this one. And then I'm gonna put glitter on one and see which one you like the best. All right, so let's do the same thing on this one. So put a bunch of glue all over this one. And now I think I didn't bring any extra white to put on the inside of the card, so. <laughs> I was just gonna do one but that's okay oh I got some jokes for you guys today too let me get the glue on here real quick so does anybody know how to fix um, Outlook if you have a new download on your Mac and all your stuff disappears is anybody a computer person out there <gasps> Uh oh my screen just uh, is not moving. Uh-oh. Oh, I think I hit something maybe. Are you guys there? Anybody there? Oh, here we go. Duck or butt jokes. Okay. <laughs> Let me see. I missed a whole bunch of stuff. Wait a minute. Blurry again. Oh no, I'm not even looking at the screen. Seems good till you move things around and then it's blurry. Check with one of your local complete. Oh, yeah, maybe there is a local one around here I could find. Yes, well, oh, here's the funny thing, Audrey. So, um, you know, when I was on the last video and I was using the um, DSP from that Horizons paper, oops, I gotta hurry up and put the, this on here before it dries up. Um, well, somebody left a comment and said, Lisa, I love you and your cards, but watching you make 10 of the same cards is really boring. And I said, <laughs> I said to myself, is she kidding me really? Because I get a lot of really positive feedback when I do the 10 and um, 20 cards. So I probably put that a little bit too low, but that's all right. All right, so let's put some sticky on here and let me read some comments real quick. Um, so I was like, dang, because that's what I was, I was actually going to do a different card tonight, but um, save that other one with the scraps for another day because I didn't want to do two 10 and 20 videos right in a row. Because I don't know if you guys feel that way. And <laughs> I was like, man, kind of hurt my feelings. So if she loves me, I don't know why she's criticizing me because if you don't like it, why do you stay and watch? Just turn it off or fast forward or something. But don't leave me a mean comment. I just don't understand that. Let's cut some of this off. So, and you know what else is funny is, you know, I can see like how many people like and um, stuff on my video because it'll say like, 57 likes and however many don't likes and I'm, I'm surprised that I actually get like three or four don't likes on every video because I'm like who does that if I don't like a video I turn it off I don't ever like leave a, a thumbs down or something I just think that's just me so I don't know I guess there's just people in the world who have to be that way but if you don't like my video, just turn it off and go somewhere else because you don't have to watch it. I'm not twisting your arm. And and don't leave me a mean comment. So there you go. All right, let's cut that off and cut that off. You just don't want to cut the paper. We're just cutting the napkin part. And oops, I need to do this edge too. And then we're going to see which one you like the best. And then we're going to put glitter on one 
All right, so one more little round of tape. I've got napkin pieces all over my desk. And there we go. All right, so fold that up. All right, so now we've got both pieces. So we've got this one and this one. Aren't they absolutely gorgeous? So I think this one does go better on the green. So I'm gonna leave that one there. And then I bought some other um, paper with me. So I've got crumb cake and soft sea foam. So <laughs> I've got pieces of napkin flying all over the place. Let me throw that away. Okay, so which color do you think goes better with this? You think it is the crumb cake or soft sea foam for this one? Which one do you want? And we're gonna put glitter on one and uh, not glitter on the other one. Okay, hold on. You guys are all laughing and I can't see. Oh, wait a minute. Check one of your local. Oh, okay, saw that one. Um, you never look at napkins the same again. Oh, everybody's saying crumb cake. Okay, definitely crumb cake. Okay, so we'll take that one away. All right, so we're gonna put this one with the crumb cake. All right, now one of them is gonna get glitter. So which one do you want to get the glitter? The crumb cake or, cause see they're beautiful just like that without glitter too. So this is, let me show you. This is what it looks like with the glitter. So what do you guys think? Which one you want glitter on or do you want just glitter? I think I'm gonna do, I have to do one without glitter though. I think this one needs glitter and this one's just beautiful the way it is. So I'm gonna leave this one without glitter. Crumb cake and glitter. Valerie, Valerie. Hey, Valerie. You made it to, oh, I should tell what happened to you, Valerie, at class today. <laughs> Can I tell the story about you, Valerie? Because <laughs> it was funny. <laughs> uh, okay, crumb cake makes it stand out. It does, I love it with the crumb cake. This one definitely matches perfectly. Can you believe that? It matches exactly the soft succulent. Um, no glitter, put it on the right side. Yeah, this one, no glitter. Okay, so I'm gonna tell the story about Valerie who's watching right now. She was in class today. So we're making the card. And so she gets this far and then we go to put the sticker paper on. So this is the one we're putting the glitter on. So here's the sticker paper. So you're supposed to peel it and then you put this down like this on the sticker paper and then you put the glitter on that so valerie puts the sticker paper like this so she puts it on the back of the card so then we're all hearing her going oh my god this is so sticky my napkin's coming off and everything so she's got this part sticky and everything's peeling off she's got napkin pieces all over her hands and goo and everything and we're all just cracking up because we're like you put it on the wrong side Valerie <laughs> it was funny I love her love you Valerie you are funny all right let's see I have done tons of lectures and you can never please everyone yep Althea says I'd still take things personally though you can't say something nice then don't say anything I know it that's how I feel all right so we're just gonna peel this off so we've got the sticky part is on the Sizzix. So that's the only thing that's harder about the other um, sticker paper is they're both white on both sides, so it's hard to tell. I think I'm gonna put it this way. All right, so you just wanna line this up with one end and make sure that the whole thing is on here. And I just got it a teeny bit crooked, but thanks to cutting it a sliver off, it will fit perfectly. I'm just gonna fold that over just for a minute. Let me find my bone folder. My bone folder. All right, so now what you wanna do is make sure you really burnish this good because you want all that stickiness to stick to your napkin. Because what happens when you peel off the backing, if it's not really stuck on there good, then you'll get like little um, 
pieces of adhesive that don't stick some places. All right, so now it's on the front, so we're gonna peel this off. Oh, let me get my glitter ready. Okay, so I like having this little edge right here to let it hang over. So when you start peeling this, make sure that you don't have any pieces that are not sticky. So it's coming off very nicely on here. So we're just gonna peel that all the way, throw it in the trash, and put the glitter on. Oh my gosh, that's so pretty. Love it. And if you have Stampin' Up! Dazzling Diamonds, that's what this is. If you don't have any Stampin' Up! Dazzling Diamonds, you can find it at any Hobby Lobby or Michaels or wherever. Or I put the link on Amazon. If you don't want to go shopping, you can get it on Amazon too. But it's ultra fine clear glitter. Oh my gosh, that's gorgeous. All right, so that's the one that's going to go on the crumb cake. So let's put that down and put my glitter away. So I'm not going to put glitter on the other one. We're just going to be different tonight. So we'll just have glitter on the one. All right, I think I'm going to put the glue on this piece and just not go up to the edge. Because I don't want to try and put it on that napkin. Okay. It goes this way. Now, I would used my other piece of white, so I don't have any white to go on the inside of the card. So you can decorate the inside however you like. Um, but I do have my little, whatchamacallit. Uh, where did we go? There we go. We have our words. So we're going to put our words on there. And I have another one. And I have my ribbon and my pearls. So we're going to do that. Okay. All right. So that's one part of the card. Then we're going to glue this one down. Whoops. I'm falling over. All right. So this one we're going to glue down too. These are just absolutely gorgeous. Love, 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 love them. All right, so this one's gonna go on here. And I'm gonna flip it over and press it. All right. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Everybody's loving it, loving it. Oh, poor Valerie, I know it. <laughs> But it was so funny. <laughs> um, yes, the dimensionals will stick to the glitter. Yes. Um. <laughs> Thank you, kitty cat. All right, so now we have these two. It's, it's a lot more vibrant without the glitter, but it's just so pretty with the glitter too. All right, so we're gonna stamp the words on here. I've got happy birthday, and I'm gonna use espresso because that'll go with everything. I don't need my glue anymore. All right, so we're doing happy birthday. Don't ask me what stamp set this is from because I don't remember. Let me scoot it in front of me so I can see. All right, so happy birthday. And happy birthday. All right, so there we go. And then, oh, guess what I found? A piece of white. Maybe we can put that on the inside of the card. And I have a dragonfly. We can do that on the front, on there. Let's take a dragonfly and stamp it for the inside. Okay. Now we can put that on the inside of the card. Whoops. Which one you want to put it on? I only have one. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. I might have two. Oh, no, I don't. All right, so we can have one inside of a card. I think I'm gonna put it on, I don't know, this one. I'll put it on that one. I'm being wishy-washy. I am so upset about my computer, I swear. And I have spent probably at least 12 hours in here trying to fix it. And I have done like every single YouTube video that said that they could fix it and all these, tips from people on the internet and nothing has worked all right we're gonna put dimensionals on the back of that so 
Sorry about the blurriness. I don't know. I'm going to have to go get my new phone and see if I can get a better internet on the phone. Because they say, I can't remember if it was Metro PC or T-Mobile or one of those supposed to be better um, service out here where I live. And it's not even like I live in the country, but I guess there's just not much else out here. All right, where do we want to put that without covering anything? Good gracious. It's so pretty. I hate to put it anywhere. Because the ribbon will hang down over that. Let's put it... Let's put it here. Okay, and then on the other one... Gosh. Debbie, I am going to have to make like a hundred of these cards because I love this napkin so much. <laughs> I'm going to have to go on Amazon and buy some more. Like right after this video before they sell out. Somebody told me that the, the uh, Dragonfly one already sold out on Amazon because of my video. Alright, that is a gorgeous card. I don't know. They're both so beautiful. Alright, so we're going to do some bows and then some pearls. So I've got my linen thread and my white um, crinkled seam binding. And both of these are staying in the next catalog. So that's good because these are my favorite ones. So we're just going to tie a ribbon. I mean a bow. And oops. I lost it. Here we go. All right. So I'm just tying a bow just like I tie my shoe. And then you just kind of pull it back and forth till it looks right. And then trim it. And let me trim that one. And that one. Oops. There we go. And then we're going to put a glue dot on the back of that. And put it on each card. So this one we'll put right here. And, oh, love it. Love it, love it. All right, and then we got to do this one. Well, this is a long video tonight, isn't it? We're already over 30 minutes. But don't complain. I don't want to see any complaints. Oh, that's another thing I'm way behind on is answering comments. So if you leave like a really quick comment, <laughs> I usually reply to that pretty fast because I can just, you know, hit like, um, you know, thank you so much. And that's it. But if you write me like a... Uh, a book it takes me a while because I want to make sure I answer like all your comments in there and so I always save those to last because I don't want to jip you and just write thanks that was a bad bow so the longer your comments the longer it takes me to get back to you <laughs> I know that's bad. but I feel like I can answer like the short ones really fast and then go back and do the long ones later because then I got to read everything when I have time. All right. Oh, I forgot my jokes. Oh, my gosh. We're almost done. I forgot my jokes. Hold on. Let me get this bow. And then I'll get them. I had to write them down because I can't remember anything for more than five minutes. Okay. Oops. These scissors, I think, need sharpening or something. They're not cutting very good tonight. All right. And then we're going to put a glue dot on that. And then we have to do some pearls. So this one, oh gosh, I don't know where to put it. There, right on the edge. That's too close to the edge though, but it's stuck now. All right, so I've got some pearls here. I'm gonna tell you a joke, the joke. Okay, now these jokes came from my friend Debbie Spicer. I have a lot of friends named Debbie. Okay, this one is a little bit on the um, risque side. Um, what, do, what did one saggy boob say to the other? I'll give you a second to think about it. What did one saggy boob say to the other? You ready? We'd better perk up or people will think we're nuts. <laughs> now, if the kid's watching, they won't know what that means. But I thought it was funny. I thought that was really cute. Okay, so that was the first one. What a good time we're having. Oh, yes, we are having a good time. Uh-oh, I can't find my... Take your pick tool. All right. 
Did you like that one? Thanks, kitty cat. Oh, the metallic mesh ribbon is staying. I love that one. Love it, love it, love it. Um, okay, hold on. Let me scroll back. I missed a whole bunch. Let's see. My three Apple products did an update over the weekend. Now the three of them can't communicate. Yes! I think that's part of it. I don't know what's going on, but... Um, oh, you know what? That one, it doesn't have green in it anymore, so we'll just do the green on this one. So I'll just use plain ones. All right, so I colored these with the dark, soft... No, that's actually... Wait a minute. Did I use the light? I used the dark, soft succulent. So I'm just going to put these on here. I should have brought, like, another color for... Oh, look how perfect that goes. <gasps> You know what we could do with this one is spray it with some... Oh, I didn't even bring it. Darn it. We could spray it with some shimmer paint. Oh my God, that's so pretty. Okay, so this one, I don't think we're going to do pearls because I only brought green. I don't think this would the plain ones would go. We're just going to leave that. Oh, you know what else I did? I put one right on the... Let me do a bigger one. And put it on my bow. So we'll do a big fat one. Okay, so we'll put this one right there on the bow. Isn't that cute? All right, maybe that's too big. I don't know, what do you think? All right, so there we go. Here's all of our cards for today. Let me move this one out of the way. All right, so what do you think? You digging the glitter or no glitter or um, what, which one is your favorite for today? I just stabbed myself with this pointy thing <laughs> right in my boob. Ouch. Oh, I got the other joke too. Hold on. Did y'all like that one? I didn't read the comments. Hold on. Let me see. Um, let's see. Mutane. What is, what does that mean? Mutane. Not a butt joke. What do you call a pile of kittens? Oh, a mutane. Oh, instead of a mount mountain, it's a mutane. Um. <laughs> okay, let me see. I got my other joke. You ready? Okay, they said a mask and gloves were enough to get into the grocery store, but they lied. Everyone else had clothes on. <laughs> I think that one's cute, too. All right, tell me which card you like the best, and I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget, I'm going to turn it off. Oh, you can't even hardly see this glitter now, can you? See it up close. Can you see all that glitter on there? And then here's the other one. So we've got sparkle or plain. I just don't even know. They're just so beautiful. All of them. But I tell you what, if you don't put the glitter on there, it only takes like five seconds to make the card, really. Well, really, even with glitter, it only takes five minutes. All right, hope you enjoyed the jokes, too. Um, have a great night. I'll be back Thursday. Hopefully, I'll have some good news about my computer because that's stressing me out a lot right now. I can't do anything else till I get that fixed because I don't know what I'm going to do. All right, thanks for joining me, you guys. I hope you enjoyed it. I'm going to turn it off on private for about 30 minutes while I edit it and then I'll put it back up in case you missed it and you wanna see the replay. It will be off for just a few minutes um, while I do the editing. So um, hold on, come back and do your comments and stuff in a little bit, okay? Thanks for joining me and as always, it was a pleasure having you and I will be back Thursday night with another one. Oh, Thursday's gonna be the, um, this one. Thursday night will be this video. So get your, if you bought that and you want to make it with me, go ahead and grab it and we'll do that Thursday night. See you guys later. Bye-bye.